have this. Thanks, dear. You're welcome, big sis. Did you take your medication this morning? Yes, I did. Can you just stop acting like mom? <laughs> what are you studying so intensely? It's for my upcoming tests. Although the lecture hasn't fixed it yet, but I'm very sure very soon he will. I trust you. <laughs> you will see. Of course I will. 100 over. told me you had an asthma attack. Hi, bestie. I feel weak, but I'll be fine. It's just that uh, it hurts me so much when it happens unexpectedly. And it's usually very scary. I can only imagine. You must have scared Debbie half to death. I hate it when she worries about it. She has to worry. She's your sister. Your only sister. I just want to let you know that you are strong. Okay? Thanks, girl. You're a good friend and I'm so happy to have you as a friend. Yeah, good friend, sir. And I'll always be here for you. Okay? Thank you so much. You're such a good friend. I just appreciate God for giving me you and my sister. You guys are the best gift. Thank you. So, you waiting for a cab? Sure, I am, but it's taking too long to get here. I just, I just hope I don't get to school late. Oh, I get it. You're headed to the university? Sure, I am. I'm headed there too. Are you a student? Yeah, a very rich student. <laughs> just kidding. I'm a graduate and left school a long time ago. But if you don't mind, I could give you a ride. And I don't mind coming back to school and then taking you back home. I have nothing done today, actually. I appreciate your offer, but I don't think I'm interested. Oh, don't worry. I understand it if you're being cautious. But trust me, I'm harmless. I'm harmless. Trust me. Hmm? My name is uh, Andrew. What's your name? I'm Vicky by name. They call me Vicky. Ooh, 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 ooh. Beautiful name for beautiful damsel. Vicky, nice to meet you, Vicky. Same here. Trust me, huh? I'm not a serial killer or something. I'm just a gentleman trying to be helpful to a beautiful lady. That's nice of you, Andrew. Mm. 
don't worry you have nothing to be worried about i'll make sure you get to your destination safe and sound that sounds great so that's a yes that's a beautiful <laughs> yes babe. Finally, we're here. <laughs> I told you I was a good driver. Hmm? Yes, you did. And I really want to appreciate you for bringing me home. The pleasure will always be mine. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Hey, Vicky, just like that. Come on. What's the problem? Hey, I would like to see you again. And uh, if it's possible, I would like to your number. All right, let me have your phone. Okay, thank you. Okay. All right, so okay. that's my WhatsApp number. Okay. You can send me a WhatsApp message. Okay, beautiful Vicky. I just saved it. <laughs> okay, thank you. All right, I'll give you a call. All right. Hey, Vicky. Hi, girl. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, good. You look so good. Thank you. So, who is the guy sorry we just now? Okay, that was Andrew. Um, we actually met today. Oh my god. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah. Ah, for you to even accept his ride, that means he must have made a very good impression. Of course. He's actually fun and Aww. loving. Aww. And guess what? what? I like the fact that he was able to persuade me to take me to school and bring me back home. You don't mean it. I'm serious. Oh my god. The guy is just so sweet. He's so interested in you. <laughs> I think my phone is ringing. Oh. He's Hello. I'm fine. Oh, okay. Um, I will think about it and um, and get back to you. <laughs> yeah, sure. I, I will. I will definitely get back to you. All right. All right. All right. Thank you. So, what did he say? <laughs> what did he say? He wants to take me on a date. So, what are you thinking about? I don't think I will say yes. Babe, all you have to say is yes. Oh. I don't think so. All you have to say is yes, let's go in. Oh. I don't think so, I don't think so. I'm not, I, I don't think so, seriously, I don't. I don't think so, baby. <laughs> I think I would say you are an amazing person. Thank you, Andrew. You're also an amazing person. I think so. Yes, you are. Thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, again, Vicky, I think oh, that it's something I've been wanting to really talk to you about. Okay, which is? <sighs> I really like you. I I adore you. You know, 
your smile, everything. Like you, you're just so beautiful. And then I would want to be more than a friend to you. <sighs> Andrew, um, I'll be very honest with you. You're a very good guy, handsome, and literally every woman's spec. But the thing here is, I don't think I'm ready for a relationship now. So I don't know if we can just be cool as friends. What? Why? Let's say because of your past relationship or why? If you think I'm handsome and so what's the problem? The thing here is, um, my last relationship wasn't good. It's not something I'm proud of. So, for now, I'm just trying to recover from my mental health issues that the relationship cost me. So, um, I'm not ready for a relationship now. Listen to me, Mickey. I already be like expecting maybe a change of mind, and if you could just give me a chance, okay? I will think about it, but I'm not giving you hundred percent assurance. <sighs> okay, it's okay. We can at least have a toast. <laughs> I have already taken some of the wine. <laughs> okay. Or we can still toast. Let's at least let's toast to expecting a yes. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This is the way our love will be. I swear. I love you forever. I would choose to live with you, even if it's for a day. Hey, rather than spend the Vicky. With Vicky. Oh. Is something a problem? You've not been okay lately. It's Andrew. He's asking me out. Okay. Have you thought about giving him a chance? Does it really matter? Yes. Even if you've been hot in the past, you have to let go and move on. Girl, I, I am scared of getting hot. I get that. I really do, but... Andrew seems like a very genuine person. Maybe you could be the one that would, you know, help you see love in a different light. Trust me. You haven't even met him before. True. My instinct tells me he's a good person. And, you know, sometimes you just have to take a leap of faith. Maybe you're right. Of course I am. <laughs> I think I should give him a chance. Sure, please do. <laughs> Why are you so sweet? <laughs> <laughs> My mouth is. <laughs> Andrew, what are you doing here? I'm just keeping up with you. Maybe I could join you for a plan. Are you following me? Uh, I'm not stalking your plans with you, man. I'm just keeping up with the fastest runner in the world. Okay, but what exactly are you doing here? Okay, Vicky, there's something I've been wanting to tell you. What is it? I would really like to get to know you. Get to meet your friend you told me about and your sister if possible. But that's actually a lot to talk about why jogging. I get it. I know it's sudden, but I I meant it. I would want you to be my girlfriend. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes, okay. 
Is the, isn't that what you want? Yeah, sure. And I promise you won't regret it. Okay. I will be your girlfriend. <laughs> Hold on, I'm coming. Surprise. Please come in. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Vicky. How are you? I'm okay, and you? Uh, I'm good. I can see you're good, looking good, as always. <laughs> I got you this in a way. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Wow. This is lovely. I'm glad you like it. And it smells so good. Trust me. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. I appreciate this. Um, by the way, okay. <laughs> hi. <laughs> hi, my name is Caroline. Yeah, nice to meet you, Caroline. <laughs> Vicky has told me a lot about you. Oh, I hope it's just good things, though. <laughs> Lots of good stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And you must be Debbie, uh, Vicky's sister. Yeah, you're right. Nice to meet you, Andrew. <laughs> nice to meet you, too. <laughs> yeah, Vicky has always emphasized on how important family is to her. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> But she never really told me you're this handsome. <laughs> Maybe because I'm not. But thank you, anyway. You're welcome. So. Okay, um, please, can you make yourself comfortable while I get you something to drink? Ah, oh, I thought you wouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. So let yeah. me get you guys. Do you want wine or juice or champagne? You know what suits me? Expensive champagne. <laughs> yeah. I got you covered. <laughs> yeah, I trust you, baby. Okay, so let me help you out. Oh, sure. Yeah, I'm fine. We need to talk. Please sit. What is it? It's about Andrew. I know he likes you, but I'm, I'm just worried. Worried about what? Since you, you need to be very, very careful. You know, your asthma isn't just a minor inconvenience. It affects your life. And Andrew might not understand what it takes to live in this condition. I understand, but he cares for me. <laughs> Does he know? I haven't told him yet, but I intend to do that very soon. He needs to know. He needs to know what he's getting himself into. It's not just about liking each other. He needs to know about the hard times too. I know. I will tell him. You sure do. Because I'm, I really want you to be happy and safe. If Andrew is the right guy for you, he's going to accept you even with you being asthmatic. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I love you. I love you too. And thank you so much for always having my back. Always. <laughs> You are asthmatic. Yes, I am. I hope I hope that won't be an issue. Because sometimes we may be together and I may have the asthma attack. <sighs> Come here. Listen to me. It won't be a problem at all. 
Thank you for telling me, though. Are you sure? Hey, come on. I hope you're not just accepting me out of sympathy. Hey, listen. I'm with you because I genuinely care about you. Okay? I genuinely care about you. Listen, listen. I appreciate your honesty, okay? And I promise that we're going to go through this thing together. I'm here for you. Okay? It's, it's not going to be easy. Living with an asthmatic patient, it's not, it's not easy. Vicky, can you stop talking, okay? <laughs> Yeah, I know it's not going to be easy, but I meant it when I say I care about you. I'm going to be with you. I'm going to be there for you in both hard and good times. Okay? We can do this, trust me. Thank you, Andrew. This means a lot to me. Vicky. I love you. This is the way I will love you should love me. Yeah. Yeah, listen, I'm in love with you. I love you too. I swear I love you forever. I would choose to live with you. <laughs> so, babe, tell me more about Andrew. I know the relationship has been going so well because you've been so happy lately. And you know, I deserve my flowers because I convinced you to give him a chance. Girl, I know. <laughs> I know you deserve your murder. Of course. Girl, do you know that Andrew is the son of a rich man? Like, he's the son of a minister. Handsome and rich. Ha. You don't mean it. Hmm. You can say that again. Like, hey, the man is my dream man. Like, Aww. he's handsome and rich. Aww. And he takes good care of me. I'm so happy for you. Thanks, dear. Thank you. You are missing out the juicy details. So tell me. Is it good or bad? Be coming down. Ah, ah what's just, the problem? Just steal it. Ah. <laughs> Tell me. Okay, the thing here is that, see, Andrew, mm -hmm. we have never done it before. Yes, we have not. And I told him that we need to wait. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes, we need to wait. When it's time, we're going to have it and everybody will enjoy it. So you want to tell me he's not getting it from somewhere else? Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> I won't make you think so. I trust him. Like, I really trust him very well. <laughs> you got a trust, man. <laughs> but the truth now, I trust him. Oh my God, you trust him. Mm -hmm. I do. Anyways, whatever makes you happy, I'm happy. <laughs> By the way, I noticed that he's not drink here, so I need to get drink for us. So do you want wine or juice? Mm -hmm. Anything work. I know what you want. You want juice, right? Before. <laughs> before, see your mouth like before. <laughs> All right, so I'm coming. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This is the way our love will be. I swear I love you forever. I would choose to live with you, even if it's for a day. Rather than spending my life with someone else Since the day, day that I found you You gave my life a meaning I cannot even imagine life with someone else This is the way our love will be You and I will be forever this is the way our love will be. I swear I love you forever. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This 
is the way our love will be. I swear I love you forever. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This is the way our love will be. I swear I love you forever. I would choose to live with you, even if it's for a day, rather than spending my life with someone else. Since the day that I found you, you gave my life a meaning. Don't mention. Listen, I will always be here for you, no matter what. Okay? I love you, don't you? Hey, don't worry. Rest assured, yeah? Everything will be fine. I promise. I got you, okay? Anyway. You'll be fine, huh? I swear I love you forever. This is the way. Why do you like my best friend? See, it's not like I don't like her. I don't... Don't just feel comfortable with her asking you too much questions about your relationship. She's just trying to be a good friend. And besides, it's because of her that I even accepted Andrew. Really? Yes. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm a healer. Again? <sighs> My heart. Okay. Are you okay? Please. Sorry. Are you okay now? I feel better. This is becoming so frequent. I noticed. I noticed that. I'm worried. Should we go to the hospital? No, no, you don't have to. I'm fine. I just need to rest. Sure. You know, I have an upcoming exams and it has been stressing me a lot. You need to take some rest. Andrew wants to take me out tomorrow. I think I should cancel it. I don't think so. Just have some rest. Before then, you'll be okay. I'll be going to my room. Just have some rest. Alright, thank you. <laughs> wow. You look amazing. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> Turn the wine for me. Oh god. <laughs> You're beautiful. Thank you. Okay. We're good to go. Sure. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I
What happened? The attack seems coming frequent. Has it been this way? No. I don't just know what's going on. Should I take you to the hospital? No, don't worry. Uh, I'm fine. I'm I'm good. Yeah. You know what? I think we shouldn't go out there no more. You know? I think you should take a rest and I wouldn't want to stress you at all. Okay? I'm sorry. Hey, my love. You have nothing to be sorry about. It's not your fault. I love you. I love you too. Yeah, I know you do. Thank you. I would like to call Caroline to come stay with me. Because my sister is not around and I don't know when she'll be back. Why? Just to take care of me. Until my sister returns. Come on, I'm 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 here with you. I'm not going anywhere. I'm right here. I know, I I understand, but she'll be very mad at me if I don't tell her about my asthma attack. <sighs> okay. If you insist, give her a call. Okay, that's it. Let me help you. The phone is here, right? Huh? <laughs> I had no idea you returned home so early. I changed my mind. I'll go there tomorrow. How are you feeling now? I'm a bit... I'm actually weak, but I'll be fine. Thank you so much, Andrew. So sorry you guys couldn't hang out. Hey, you don't have to apologize. I totally understand. She's my girl, so... I feel weak, like all my muscles everywhere. I feel pain all over my body. You'll be fine, okay? I just want to rest. Debbie, your sister needs quality rest. Sure. Okay. I'll take her upstairs then. Yeah. Come on, babe. Go. Easy, okay? Uh -huh. All right. Andrew, please don't leave yet. So I could prepare something for all of us. Yeah, that would be nice actually. Okay. I will wait. Mm. Hey, what is your problem? You are my problem. You know what I want. I don't understand. What can you, what do you want? Hey. Andrew, I really like you. I know it's not a case of love at first sight, but I would have not convinced the kid to fall in love with you or to, to even accept being your girlfriend because I really want you. Can you let something come over you? I don't understand. What are you doing? Oh my God. Can, can you just like, just move, move a bit? You, you're coming too close to me. Just, just move. Andrew. Stop it. You know what, what are you? Hey. So don't make it seem like a kiss. Can you just move? Am I not attractive enough? Or do you want to be with someone that is always sick? Is that the kind of person you want to spend the rest of your life with? And who are you referring to? You know who I'm referring to. Don't make it seem. <laughs> so how is she now? <sighs> She's asleep now. Andrew, do you care for a drink? Thank you, Debbie, but I, I'll be fine. Caroline, please, can you help me out in the kitchen? Sure. Goodness, it must have fallen when I was sleeping. Come 
morning. Good morning, sis. How are you feeling today? Is everything okay? Debbie. Yeah? Look. This is not my inhaler. Really? It looks different. How? It has even expired. Is that why you've been having frequent attacks since you started using it? Maybe. I think so. You've been having frequent attacks since you started dating Andrew. And this is not a coincidence. This is deliberate. What are you trying to say? I'm not saying it has something to do with it. I'm just trying to tell you that you need to let you know what's going on. Wow. I think I have a meeting with him today at our favorite restaurant. Maybe you can come along with me because we need to find out why this is different. This is old. Mine is new. I have no choice. I have to follow you then. Please, just dress up. We need to go now. Okay. Vicky, are you sure it's a different inhaler? Yes, I'm very sure. This is not my inhaler. This is an old inhaler. Mine is very new and this inhaler has even expired. And you were sure somebody didn't tamper with it deliberately? I don't know. I'm, I'm confused. It could have been you. Maybe somebody in school that don't like you, or maybe someone that is jealous of your relationship with him. Oh my God. What is what? this? <sighs> Vicky, there's something I think I've been keeping from you. What is it? It's Caroline. I don't think she's actually happy with our relationship. She, she tried to seduce me. She told me to leave you for her. What? Are you just telling me now? Oh, Vicky, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I thought I could handle this on my own. Why keep such secrets away from me? Oh my God. I'm, 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 I'm really sorry, Vicky. I thought I could handle this on my own. This is so deep. It's not something you should keep away from me. I hate secrets. I understand and I'm really sorry. I should have been honest with you from the very beginning. The day you introduced us, she, she, she said she likes me. And, but trust me, I, I told her off. I, I, I didn't actually listen to her. Sis, I'm sorry. Maybe he was just trying to protect you from unnecessary worries. I know, David. Your secret has consequences. This is not nice. And we need to confront Caroline. Sure, we will. Because we need to get to the bottom of this. Babe, um, I'm really sorry. Okay? This song is this. Yes. It's okay. Uh, I think you, you would need a new inhaler right away. Right? Sure, I, 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 sh I will. I should. It's okay. It's okay. Taking it is okay. What's going on? <laughs> Vicky asked me to come here. Where is she? We know what you did, Caroline. You are trying to sabotage Vicky's health, right? So you can have Andrew to yourself. What? Upcoming boyfriend snatcher. God forbid. I would never do anything to hurt Vicky. Shut up! Liar. I think we don't know your attempt to seduce Andrew and your manipulations towards Vicky's inhaler. Caroline. How could you? I'm sorry. How could you do this to me? I'm so sorry. I'm so you told... Andrew, mockery things about me. Because I'm asthmatic. Why? I was jealous, okay? I wanted Andrew for myself. What? You didn't deserve him. This is the way I will love. 
I don't deserve him. That's why he betrayed our friendship. Seriously, Caroline. I'm sorry. About in Hela, it was you, right? You put Vicky's life at risk. How did this happen? When? I'm truly sorry. Please forgive me. When did this happen? The inhaler. <laughs> it was when we studied together. By the way, I noticed there is no drink here, so I need to get a drink for us. So do you want wine or juice? Mm, anything will work. I know what you want. You want juice, right? Before. Before. <laughs> See your mouth like before. All right, so I'm coming. Okay, girl. <laughs> oh, Have your drink, girl. your favorite. This apple juice, actually. Oh, you know me so well. <laughs> well, wait, why do you like this apple juice so much? I beg, I beg, let me, let me, let me. I know more even talk like this. I, know. I'm trying to read. So read. For your mind now. I beg. I'm sorry. I switched that inhaler with an expired one. I did not want to trust me. You're wicked. Since we need to cut ties with her, we don't need her around us anymore. No, no, I'm sorry. It's the devil's work. It's the devil. The devil. Caroline. The devil. Because you were caught, right? No, no. No. It's fine. We are not friends anymore. Oh. Hey, babe. Babe. Wait. Please let me talk to your sister, please. Come on, get it's out. the devil, please. You're no more welcome here. Debbie, get out! Get out. Debbie, 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 no, Debbie. Debbie, no, please. I love you forever. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This is the way. Thank you so much for everything you have done. I won't have done this without you. Thank you. Come on, babe. I've told you to stop thanking me. I I love you so much. I love you too. And I wouldn't have done this without you. You know, with the help of my sister and you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, we got each other. We're happy to have each other. So. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, that's by the way. I think um, I have a surprise for you. <laughs> you have come again. Mm -hmm. What is it? Uh, just what? close your eyes. <laughs> no, I want to open one eye. No, come on. <laughs> just, just for a minute. Okay. Yeah, that's my goal. Okay. At the count of two. Okay. One. And two. Open. Okay. <gasps> Vicky, would you marry me? Oh my god! Is this a joke? Hey, I'm, I'm serious. Would you marry me? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. yes. I'll marry you. Let's do this. <laughs> Ah, oh. Mm. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mm. 
<laughs> come here, come here, come here. Oh my god, I'm so Thank lucky you. to have you. This is the way our love will be. You and I will be forever. This is the way our love will be. I swear. Spending my life with someone else